Carmen currently works 30 hours per week at her part-time job. If her gross hourly wage were to increase by $1.50, how many fewer hours could she work per week and still earn the same gross weekly pay as before the increase? So let's think about this. Right now, she has a certain wage, an original wage, and that wage times 30 is her gross pay for the week. Now, this wage increases by 1.5, and we want to know how, what is the new number of hours. So I'll just write new hours here. And so if we knew her current wage, then we could figure out what her new wage is, and we'd be able to solve for the new hours. So anything that allows us to figure out her, her current wage, that would allow us to answer the question. So statement number one tells us that her gross weekly pay is currently $225. So in other words, W, her wage, times 30 hours equals $225. Well, that by itself would allow us to calculate W, and once we know W, we would calculate the new hours. And so this by itself is perfectly sufficient. Now forget statement number one, let's work on statement number two. The increase of $1.50 would represent an increase of 20% of her current gross hourly wage. So 0.2 times W equals $1.50. Well, again, we'd be able to solve for W, and once we know W, we could solve for the new hours. So this statement by itself is sufficient. Both statements are sufficient. Answer choice D.